you in hell, bitches! Ugh. Ah! Well. That's, uh... That's embarrassing. Hello, everybody. Grace to a place, and we're back with more My Summer Dark Souls. Someone likened this game to the Dark Souls of car building, and they're completely correct. I think that they said, like, it's essentially Dark Souls, but less forgiving. You may be asking, Gray, why are you in the port john over here with a giant case of beer? That's because I didn't have any urine left, so I had to drink a bunch to make some. Because, quite frankly, I feel inappropriate. Starting the game without taking a whiz somewhere. Let's go ahead and get this done real quick Things are so screwed up right now. I have to try and Get to Sunday because someone said that there's a road race that goes on on Sunday over by Lope Someone also said that this guy's name is Timo. I Feel like I don't know man. I mean you must be right, but way back when and I don't know if he'll say it hold on here I think I have finished strength off hopefully Tervetuloa Teemu. Ei Ah, he was about to say it! I could have sworn that, like, way back when I started, and, I, and I'd have to probably look at, like, you know, episode freaking one or something like that. Well, I didn't even think I got here in episode one. It probably took me, like, 45 episodes. That he said, like, time, time o' coppa or something like that. But, man, it must be Timo though. Oh, whatever. You guys were giving me some suggestions on how to make this yeah, fort no, stronger. Yeah, oh, yeah. no! Oh God, he's talking again. How I can make this better and not collapsing. And you guys were saying, why not make it where you do two walls, like a wall and then a backer wall. That's probably a better idea than what I've done over here. And someone else had mentioned, why not put a vehicle behind one of the walls so that it's kind of like utilizing that for extra support. That will probably work as well. The other thing I have to think about is what the hell I want to use for a roof. I need something big enough to flap across here because I'm not really sure there's a way for us to use beer cases. So what we're gonna do is we have to check and see if this road race actually exists first off. People are talking about the ghosts. Now the ghost thing, from what I understand, there was an issue where some players activated some files that weren't really supposed to get activated. And then the developer was like, no. So then he had to remove it and, or I don't know, seal them away or something. I don't know. I'm not a freaking developer or anything. I don't know how it goes. I just know that uh, I guess that's what happened as per the forums. Also, it looks like an update may be coming because he asked what the worst, uh, when I say he, I mean topless gun over there. He asked what the worst uh, turns were for the rally because that's where he wants to put spectators. Oh, oh God. So kill you right now is my source of income and it'll probably be my source of income for a while because you can make a lot of money with kill you. Let me tell you something. You can make decent money sucking poop and stuff like that as well. I keep the crap tanker right around here because there was full wells all around those areas. And they've, they've probably been full for like the last 30 episodes. So that works pretty good as well. But I'm gonna probably keep it right up against the wall over there just for just such an occasion. It's a sad, a sad a day when I have to use the friggin' van over here to move beer from one side of the road to the other side of the road. To be fair though, I think that this is going to be much, much faster than any other way I could think to do it. Unless I got the super strength, like, just so, where it was absolutely perfect. But the chances of me being able to do that are incredibly low. All right, you heartless game. Let's see if I can make you do your thing. Some people, well, I think I, I think only saw like maybe like one or two. But some people were like, Gray, I built a house of beer cases. Screenshot or it didn't happen, suckers. Make sure to put that stuff over on Twitter. I want to see it anyway. You can talk about it, but I gotta, you gotta be about it, all right? You gotta share that stuff. Don't keep it to yourself, okay? Because if there's a technique for building a better beer house, everyone needs to know. That's not something that you should keep to yourself. Let me tell you something. This double wall is looking real good. Look at- oh shit, I just threw that. That wasn't supposed to happen. Thank you, God, for not destroying the wall. Looking real damn good. You can see. This was a good idea. 
The only problem is, is that it is going to take a ton of beer cases to double up on the wall. Um, I've got a lot of beer. I don't know if I have that much beer. You guys were saying too, drink all of the beer. The only issue is, I think that you pass out way before you can like finish a large quantity of beer. Like I could try and drink as many as I can. The kill you now, you could get pretty far with the kill you. Okay, if you wanna, if you wanna friggin' knock yourself senseless, the kill you is the way to do it. What the hell's going on here? Crap, give me my beer. There we go. Up, oh, we're hungry. Don't worry though. Emergency ra uh, ration sausages happen to be right over here. Remember, we left those the last time our car exploded or whatever happened, and they've been laying there ever since. Thank God. Isn't this amazing that this is what the game has become? Although, I guess realistically, that's what this game always was. This. Don't you, don't you freaking do it. I will cut you so slow. You won't even know you've been cut. That's what this game always was, though. This game wasn't about. It wasn't about getting tons of money or or ruling the world or building a civilization. This that is looking very very worrisome right there. This game was always about doing dumb crap and trying not to get arresticated recently now. But I kind of like that about it. Like part of the game makes me want to stab myself in the eye with a beer bottle. But another part of the game seems almost relaxing or therapeutic. Now, this doesn't happen very often, mind you. I'm just saying that it, it, it can potentially occur under a very, very specific set of circumstances. I think we only need to go, like, maybe too... Like, maybe, like, too high on the secondary backing. I think that should be enough to keep everything pretty sturdy. Oh, thank you God for the finished headbutt. Otherwise, this would be a real pain in the nuts. I think that should be enough to keep everything pretty damn sturdy. Let me go check this out. Now, I'm going to have to check with finished super strength to see if there's anything. Oh, God, really? To see if there's anything in particular. All right, hold on. Let me open up the side door. Anything in particular that we can go ahead and use for a ceiling. I'm wondering if we could use, like, maybe the, uh, the bus stop chunks or something. I don't really know. The other problem is I don't know how this stuff will buckle under the weight. And if it buckles too much, Gray might go insane and choke himself with his own freaking computer cord or something. Okay. Things are looking pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and save the game just to make sure that nothing explodes before I have to shoot myself. Now, I kind of wonder the way this game spawns things in. Is this wall gonna... What the hell is going on over here? Why is there a giant opening right here? Do you see this bullcrap? Look at that. There's a giant opening right here. Oh, you gotta be freaking kidding me. Oh, don't you do it. Don't you do it. If I put this down there, is everything gonna fall? I feel like everything's gonna fall. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> Screw you, game. This victory goes to Gray. Suck on my wiener, you bastard. With the power of science, it's now Sunday, but I still have 19 jail days left. This wall, not looking good, man. Not looking good. What's with the storms going on? All I want to do is see if there's a damn road race going on over here. Holy crap. Inside of the uh, van we go, because this is now our go-to vehicle at the moment until I get the Satsuma off from the freaking roof of my, uh, my house. I should probably grab a beer case for this because you never know, man. We may, we may need it. I don't know how long I'm gonna be out in this thing. And remember, kids, don't drink and drive. Whatever you do, never do this. It's very dangerous. Oh, I wonder if I can throw it out. Hold on. Yeah, right there. I think I, I think it went flying back into the vehicle or something. What is this ahead of us? Because it's taking a long time for me to see it. Oh, it's just the other crappy van. It's very similar to our van, only it's yellow. I kind of wish I had a yellow van. I like yellow the color. I like it. I would say I like it more than blue, but less than green. Look at that. Beer case. Right in the middle of the road. Another fallen beer case. It's sad. All right. Here we are at Lope. Now, supposedly, it happens... 
It happens out by the bus stop, which is back out this way. I could also steal this jackass's car. I haven't done that in a while. But I just wanted to double check that this is where we're supposed to be. And it definitely looks like it is. Go back over here. Oh, look at this guy over here. He's still out hanging around. I probably should have brought the tanker so I could suck up more crap and make some more money. Hey, buddy. Pardon. Don't mind if I just kind of flip a dude past you there. Man, this thing is absolutely garbage off-road. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're doing good now. There we go. On the dirt roads, it does okay. I'm talking about, like, the grassy areas. When you get out to the grass there, it is a fight for freaking survival, and you don't want to be a part of it. I'm telling you. All right. Here we go. Oh, I see something in the distance. What is that? Was that right there? That's just a regular car. That's just a regular scumbag. I'm not really worried about that. Sometimes people ask, if you ask, uh, like, how do you change the days and stuff like that? You have to use something called the My Summer Car Editor, I think it is, or something. You can edit all kinds of crap with it. Um, I'm at the point now where we've done so much stuff, and sadly, you know, that's the other problem, too. I've, I've got, like, a hundred some odd hours in the game. Actually, I probably have a little bit more than that. I'm at the point now where to get stuff done, it takes a little bit longer than a poor family guy like me has time for. So I have to choose. I have to choose between teleporting time ahead or spending time with my family. I feel like the family's the right choice because if I stop doing it, they may get pissed off at me. But yeah, I'm gonna put a link in the description below. So if you guys wanna check it out, you can. Um, it's kind of easy to use. I remember I did a tutorial for something. I can't remember what the hell it was for. I can't remember if it was for that or if it was for paint jobs or something. I, I don't really remember. The tutorial was kind of like, eh, I'm not a huge fan of doing tutorials. I'd rather just mess around and, like, drink beer and stuff like that. It's pretty late. It's pretty late. I don't know where these guys are. We're over by Lope. That's for damn sure. We got the bus stop right over here. Is that the bus? Nope. That is just a regular giant-ass truck. Now, it's also totally possible that I've been trolled and that there are no street races on Sunday nights. But... I had to at least check it out because at this point, all the different little legends and stuff like that, I got to see. I have to see if there's any legitimacy to it. The other problem is we're going to have to go to sleep eventually. Oh, you know what I could do? I could try the police evasion technique. We'll try and go to sleep back at our house and then teleport out of the house utilizing the mini bike and we'll see if that works. I'm pretty sure it will. You can't drink and drive. But you can drink and not drive. I remember, I think it was a Beam NG video, and I think they were kidding, but it was still funny to see, because I've, uh, I've been joking about the whole disclaimer thing, which does have some legitimacy to it, because I was talking to YouTube about that kind of stuff. And, uh, they were like, I made, like, a Beam NG video, and, you know, all my videos on that are, like, crashing and cars dying and exploding and everything like that, and they were like, you didn't put a disclaimer that people shouldn't try this at home. And I was like, well, actually, I didn't say anything. But a bunch of people were like, are you being sarcastic? And I think they were being sarcastic. But anyway, the point is, is that if you have Beam NG, definitely try it at home because it's amazing. If you don't have Beam NG and you want to recreate the stunts with your own vehicle, don't do it because it, it will make you sad and it will make your insurance company happy. See how that works? You will be sad. Your insurance company will be happy. We don't want that because the insurance companies only do two things. They take and they deny. They take your money and they deny your claim. Real dark out here. It's actually a little scary. It's weird because like in Finland here, it doesn't look dark. Like if you see, there's like a, there's like a horizon. It almost looks like it's going to be a beautiful day. But holy God. I can't see the hand in front of my face. Like, legitimately. Hold on here. Oh, I can I can see those hands. Where where's my other hand at? Where's the where where's the There it is. See that? The dick of the pussy? You can't even see it. Oh hey, my jail days just went down. Well that's nice. Although it's still Sunday, which is weird. But whatever. That's fine. I don't know, man. I've been out here for a long time. A long damn time pretty pretty eerie out here actually I think I'm gonna have to head home 
Maybe, maybe the Sunday that we were on wasn't the real Sunday. Maybe this is the real Sunday. Because like I said, my jail time went down. Maybe the, maybe in Finland you get two Sundays. That would be awesome. Man, I'd have to move there. You guys work on Sunday? God, I hope not. Well, I guess it depends on what type of work you're in. Oh, come on, man. Oh, I can't even see where the... Oh, oh. There we go. Okay, good. Sweet Jimin and Jack Wagons. It is freaking dark as hell. I can't... Did I just see something? Hold on. I need to I need to check something real quick. Real quick. I don't think I did. But I just I wanna be oh crap. I don't wanna hate trees either. I wanna be doubly sure. Every once in a while. Now, nope, doesn't seem to be anything there. Every once in a while. I feel like I see something on the side ouch. On the side of the road. I'm still looking for that damn jackalope. See, what you don't know is that Finland actually exists in an alternate dimension. A dimension where the sun cannot reach. That's why it's so damn dark outside. It's like, it's like when, when the nighttime comes, the sun, it just doesn't reflect off the moon at all. Or maybe just, maybe Finland doesn't get a moon. I'm not certain. Remember every once in a while when I say like, if I died right now, I would start crying? This is one of those times because to you guys, I've been playing for like, I don't know, maybe like 12 or 15 minutes, but really it's been an hour and a half. So I don't want, <laughs> I don't want to lose that much of my life and start back from square one. That would. Oh, it's the it's the cuckoo bird. Oh my god. Oh, that means it's morning. We've been we've been driving around straight through morning. It's probably like two, three o'clock in the morning. Right now, guys, put your bets in. What time do you think it is? I'll check the clock. Oh, this is the death turn. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Right here. That death turn. You can see where I usually hit this turn and flip the car. There's all the sausage and stuff on the ground. See, I know. I know where I crashed. Developer, if you want to talk about turns the worst rally turns, I'll have to go back and look where all the beer and sausage on the ground is. Because if I can find that, I can tell you where the worst turns for me are. All right, we are back. Yes. Wait a second. Oh, the other cop must be hidden. I was like, is there only one cop there? That'd be weird. Oh, oh shh. There we go, okay. Now, while I can still see, let me go over here, well, still see. While I have the lights on, so I can kind of tell what's what really. I hate you so much, you ri Are you gonna, okay, open? No, open, there we go. Grab the mini bike over here, there we have it. Bring this thing outside, we're gonna, we're gonna try this here. I'm gonna try your guys' suggestion. Right over here. Now, you know what, actually, we could finish headbutt this thing inside, but I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it outside. I'm gonna put outside just to be doubly sure. Hold on, shit. Hold on, come here. There we go. And there, yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 no, no, no. Oh, okay. All right. Yep, 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 yep. I think I had it perfect before, and now I'm just screwing everything up. All right. Tilt it that way. Lean it against the wall. Wow. Perfect. Right there. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Okay. Now. We don't want to go to sleep with the car on, so I have to find the ignition in the friggin' dark because I think I left my flashlight back over by the, uh, I don't know where the hell I left my flashlight. Oh, hey, hold on, hold on. There's our car, by the way, up on the, up on the friggin' roof. Hey! Oh, man. All right, well, whatever. We'll try, we'll try better next time. All right, so just teleport in here. Yes! Yes! Ha 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 ha! Oi, oi, oi. You bastards should have known. Oh, what was that? Oh, hey, look everyone. It's my car door. That's interesting. That's interesting. I wonder if I could teleport through the ceiling by utilizing that. So I assume what happens, yep, is the door closes so that I can open it and these guys can uh, show me my arrest warrant. Well, guess what? Hold on here, you friggin' haters. Okay. Just get the sausage, there we go. So you gotta sneak that right out from him, man. Sneak it like that. This is how I can continue to make money here too with the kill you. That's fantastic. No fine anymore because once you decide to go to jail, your fine is erased. Okay. So, first things first. 
first things first. The question is, can we teleport out using that? I'm assuming we can, but I have to go ahead and clean myself off real quick. Can you not piss on the sauna anymore? This is a travesty of justice. You gotta be kidding me. It doesn't work anymore. Oh God. Oh God, don't tell me that you have to wait for the sauna to get to its full, its full temperature again like you used to. Let me tell you something. If you boys weren't here for that incarnation of the game, consider yourself lucky. Hold on, let's test this. Oh God, maybe I just missed. I, I may have just missed, hold on. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, topless gun, no, you changed it. <laughs> oh, it's back to the original way it used to be. Where you have to wait. No. The way it was, okay, so the way it used to be was you used to have to wait for the temperature to get into like the, uh, like I think it was between 80 and 100. But the problem was is that the temperature gauge sometimes wouldn't move. Not like it would move slowly, like it would not move. So there was no way to do it. So it seemed to have gotten fixed where as long as you had this turned on, you could use the sauna. But now it looks like it's back to the original way where it doesn't work like that anymore. Yep. I even saved and reloaded and everything. And the sauna doesn't seem to work like it used to. I am going to eat a friggin' frisbee because that right there sucks. You gotta be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. How about if I take the pail? How about if I take the pail? Nope, that doesn't work either. I thought maybe if I just spilled all the water out, something would happen. Guys were saying that you could have a house fire. I think it's possible that that was uh, taken off the build as well. Like it was activated inappropriately when it's taken off. I've, I haven't been able to get the house on fire. Now it's totally possible that just like getting arrested and people continue to ask, how do you get arrested? Remember, eight in-game hours, in-game. So not out of game. You have to be in the game for eight hours to get arrested and then go to sleep and then they'll come to your door. I wonder if there's an in-game amount of hours that you have to let pass before this burns the house down. All right, well, in the meantime, let's see if we can teleport out of here. Hold on. Let me see here if I can, oh shit. Oh, I don't know, boys. I don't know. Oh, oh, what the hell? I'm like, I'm like through the window. This is curious. Well, whatever. Um, how about if I crouch down? If I crouch down, can I get there? Man, I'm down low. Low. Really? I can't get on it? You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. All right, that's fine though. Because the finish headbutt solves every problem imaginable. Every problem. All right. Uh, here we go. How'd this door get closed? Did I close that door? Oh, it must have been when I saved or something. All right. Now, get pick this up. Here we go. We're going to do a little bit of a getaway here. No big deal. Okay, so we got that. Oh, crap. I got to turn the thing on. Now, you guys were saying that this works. So, I'm going to give it a shot. All right. There's Officer Porkums over there. It's all right, though. We got it going on. There we go. Okay. Here we go. See you in hell, bitches. Ugh. Well, that's, uh, that's embarrassing. Oh, no. Oh, okay, we're good. Can I close this? Whoa! Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Yes! <laughs> Not the day, homie. And there you go, boys. We did it. We escaped. I'm fine. We escaped. It's totally possible with the mini bike. All you have to do is just kind of squeeze against the old portly officer there and close the door. And you are freaking set to go. Ride the mini bike in the rain on the dirt roads of Finland. You boys know how it is. Look at this, man. 
I can drive the mini bike better on these dirt roads than I can drive the actual rally car. What's that all about? Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of My Summer Car. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love. <laughs> right into the stratosphere. Yes. Yeah. Oh, we landed eventually.